اريوم هلو ماي فريندز I just finished the satsang of today and when I wanted to turn off the recording I came aware oh oh it has happened again after maybe one and a half year I didn't record the satsang so there we are <laughs> Anyhow, we have recorded many satsangs. We will record many satsangs. What matters is how we are turning what we are talking about into our daily life, how we are manifesting it in our daily life. In the beginning of today's satsang, I said, well, many times I have been telling that this is a very special time, that it is very, that there is a great intensity. And it's very important that in this special time that we are alert not to be sucked into negativity. Because if we do so, there are forces that really waiting for it to push us more into that. But at the same time, if we open up to the light, to harmony, harmony, if we open up to expansion, there is also a great force ready all the time to come <clears throat> and help us. But in spite of that, it's very good to remember, hey, this is a dreamlike experience. That which is, is prior to that. That what you are is before this experience of this world, of being human. It's during this time, it's there when this experience of being human disappears. And it is that what we are looking for, that ground, that base, that source that makes all this experience possible. And if we remember that it is possible to play our role, to be in this world and do it in a way, in a playful way, in a joyous way, benefiting from getting richer for the experience and radiating actually something that also others are benefiting. But this That which is, is prior to dark and light, prior to good or bad. It is that which makes everything possible. And then the question is, why should we then at all be busy opening for the good? Why should we then at all make the effort of opening Put light if what we are looking for is beyond that. Very simple. Because if we are getting sucked in a, with our consciousness into negativity, it's contracting consciousness. And contracting consciousness is always pain, it's always suffering. And in that state of pain and suffering, it's very difficult to have the presence of mind, to have the heart to connect with that essence. And although the essence is beyond darkness 
or light. It's beyond bad or good. If we open up to the light, if we open up to becoming more expensive, then in that condition, it's much easier to remember. Because then consciousness is at ease. It's natural for consciousness to be expansive. And if we are in that more natural state where the consciousness is not being impaired from being expansive, then it's much easier to turn the attention back to that which is even prior to that. So it is not a contradiction that I'm always urging, come on, open up for the light. Don't get sucked into negativity and connect with the essence. The essence is prior to all that, but it's much easier to tune into that and to become aware and to remember. And then when we remember to take the step of bringing the attention back home, to our true nature, to the essence. Going for that and being positive and opening to the light is not a contradiction. All right. My apologies for not having recorded the satsang. Next time, the recording will be on again. I wish you all well. Are you? Are you? Are you?